A happy day going into the backfield with the goat friends and cow. All the goat friends together, even Mr. Buckles, who's harassing all the ladies. They're all knocked up now so he can get to know them and fight with cow and the little buck. Oh, wow. <laughs> Good job, Badger. I do not understand why the cow is most excited about all of this. I think it's because she's in love with Mr. Buckles. And that's the third little buck, Cinnamon Toast. I wonder if he's going to make a mess or if he's just going to hide in plain sight. Go Cinnamon Toast, go! Find your mom, graze by yourselves, be free. It is December 26th and there's still plenty of grass on the ground. We've gone over this area a couple times, but we'll find something nice up here. What this behavior means. I, I've never interacted with a cow except for this one. And this one's never met a cow. And she's really, really excited about Mr. Buckles. So, Badger Nibbles, the little one, has already knocked up all of these ladies that we're sniffing at. <laughs> Mr. Buckles has fathered many of the children, like that black and white one, and Beans here, and um, Lottie, and Sasha off of Lottie. And that one, Space Master, who likes to threaten little Badger. That's Space Master's brother, Market Moore, also likes to fuck with Badger. Badger's got no horns, but their weathers, they're gonna go. Bye-bye, guys. Pretty soon. Soon as December manages to be cold enough for January at this point, once January manages to be cold enough to actually be able to kill six or seven goats in a day, not go above 40. Well, this is a bit of life with the goats. Signing off.